Hi everybody, I just wanted to do a quick video to show you how you can output IPA uh, pronunciation guidelines for the words that you're studying in uh, a language. So the way that I do this is on a Linux machine I um, have a, installed a program called eSpeak. Uh, you can do that yourself just by doing uh, sudo apt-get install eSpeak. Uh, obviously it won't do it for me because I already have it installed. Um, but then you feed it in um, either by standard in or a file, uh, the words that you want translated into IPA pronunciation. Now I have um, prepared a small file with some French words in it and if I'm going to convert that to IPA all I need to do is run it quickly through a loop so it goes through. So a bit of programming but not really difficult. So for the word in I cat the file. So, T do echo. Oh, sorry. Echo dollar word. That's just to echo the word that I'm actually changing, and then you do e speak minus VFR to tell it that it's a French um, file, that the words are all in French, and you do minus minus IPA to tell it that you want the pronunciation to be IPA, because actually it has other pronunciation guides available when you speak, but we want IPA in this example. And then you just tell it the word that you're going to convert, and then it will loop through the file, picking out the word and giving you the IPA pronunciation uh, for the word. Now you don't need to echo the word so if you go back and just remove the echo command you'll just get the IPA as you can see. Now the way that I typically do this is I have the file, I normally have a CSV file, uh, I would save that and then I'd run this loop and I would out put it to some IPA dot text file and then with a little bit of manual tidying up um, you see that um, you have a file with the words in in the same order in which the other file is and so you can basically just um, open up a spreadsheet program put these two things together, open up Google Sheets, uh, do a Google Translate function so that you can basically create a spreadsheet which has the uh, target language word, the IPA pronunciation for that word, and then the translation. And with that you can make Anki um, flashcards or do whatever you, you need to do with it. But it's very, very good for pronunciation. Now the other thing you can do is you don't actually need to um, put it into a file. You can do the same thing um, with the same commands and then just put in uh, any word that you want and it'll output the IPA for pronunciation. So that's just a quick and easy way to do eSpeak. Now eSpeak is an open source program so it's freely available and it does compile under Windows and Macs um, but you'd have to work out how to install it. Um, but anyway, that's a, a quick and easy way to get IPA.